mark in the water. I know I'm in, I know I'm in the water. Yesterday was my birthday and Ooh, this, yesterday's my birthday and we went to Disneyland. It was fun. It was it was fun. We went at night after school. That was Thursday. Now it's Friday. I didn't go to school today. I'm not gonna answer that. And I've been cooking all day. I've made a lot of food. Three HelloFresh meals, all for my mom. And now I'm gonna make me food. I'm debating between a peanut, okay, what is it? Ginger chicken meatball with creamy peanut sauce. Delish, that sounds very good. Or healthy Thai, uh, Thai turkey meatballs with coconut curry. Both sound really good. I could make both because I have ground turkey and ground chicken. I was planning to use a ground chicken for something else. I could do both. Well, this changes everything. Oh my God. Now I'll get back to you. I'm gonna, make, I'm gonna start with the peanut sauce because I've never made peanut sauce before and I make a lot of BRB. I've decided on the peanut sauce, and I'm also gonna make monkey bread. I have two hours, I think I can do this all. I hope I can do this all. Oh my God, I look balls. Okay, I need to push this up a little. And my acne's bad, I know, we get it. Don't have to get over it. Oh, I need to do the dishes too. Okay, I need to do the dishes and come back. A Little bit later, I'm making the peanut sauce now. Or the ginger meatball, ginger chicken meatballs with peanut sauce. Okay, so to make the meat, so you make the, wait, let me read the directions. I should probably do that. Okay, so I all make it on the stove. Okay, so I mix chi ground chicken, egg, almond flour, cilantro, garlic, ginger, and season it with salt and black pepper. So I'm gonna do that first because then while that cooks, I make the peanut sauce. I'm gonna grab a bowl. I was gonna make monkey bread. I don't know if I'll have time to do that, honestly, though. I kind of feel like I'm still going to. I don't know, how long, how, what does that take? What is that? Oh my God, all I have to do is put into a food processor and then bake. Okay, wait. Oh, I've been doing this, okay. Okay, I actually finally did it. It actually looks good. Okay, but it needs to simmer for 15 minutes. So I am going to make the monkey bread. I have to put the dates into a food processor. I need to figure that out. like I know that's not what's supposed to look like but it's fine I got breakfast. It's nine o'clock, well, nine one now. But I just been listening to music and walking. I wasn't gonna walk this far, and then I did. And I was gonna drive to the farmers market because it's about a mile away. But I've already walked there. Today I'm gonna walk around the farmers market, go back to my car. I still have to do it at home, so I shouldn't be here too long. I don't know. I have ten minutes left on my meter. I think I'm gonna add like fifteen or twenty more minutes. I don't know. But I'm gonna go to the farmers market. I love Laguna. I wish I could live here. I act like I do. Anytime I can act like I live here, I do. Like every weekend, I'm here. Sometimes both days, sometimes all day, sometimes during the week. Like it's getting a little out of hand. But who doesn't want to be in Laguna Beach? <gasps> Plaza right now and I got some gift cards for my birthday so I am going to go shopping and there's people staring so I'm not gonna do this in public. Our first stop is William Sonoma. Sonoma's my favorite place in the world. I'm having more 
off on the Disneyland. Literally playing Winter, Winter Wonderland. This is my Winter Wonderland. Winter Wonderland. Oh, of course! <laughs> So machine I am so grateful to get an express machine I can't even describe how long I've wanted one I've been obsessed with coffee for like way too long as I just turned 17 probably like four or five years I've been drinking coffee since I was 12 whatever I stopped growing in like second grade different story that's it it's so beautiful oh my god okay I'm not gonna do that it's the Barista Touch Impress by Breville. Oh my god, it's in my house. Oh my god. The shock is still setting in. I am gonna set it up though. So I wanted to film me setting it up. I'm so, oh, I need to buy beans though so I can make coffee tomorrow. I don't know where I'm gonna put it then. I think I'm gonna put it in this corner. We used to have a Keurig right there. So I think I'm gonna set it up. I hope it's tall enough. Oh shit. I hope it's tall enough. Okay, this might be a process. Okay. Okay, it definitely, it literally barely, okay, so this is a box now, but that's barely fitting. I hope it's, okay, box-wise, it should fit perfectly. Oh my god, it's 22 pounds. Damn, I'm strong. Okay. Oh, there's a, oh my god, there's an app. Okay. Oh, what's my Apple ID? I can't be the one who always forgets her Apple ID and has to reset it every other day. Every single time I log in, I think I reset it. I need to write it. I always say that and every single time I forget it. So, wait. It's- Oh, no. Oh my god, it takes an hour. Okay, it says unboxing and first use. Hopefully, everything. Okay, I should probably start unboxing then. I don't want to do this for an hour. I might take a break. <gasps> oh my god. Do you see this? I'm gonna get so good. You guys will see my progress. I'm gonna get so good at the design. I'm gonna watch only videos on that. That's my whole hobby now. I need to get friends so I can hold coffee nights. Like, you know, not coffee nights, but like, Sunday, come to my house, croissants, oh, I don't know. I'll start making croissants and we'll have coffee. I did actually have a mental breakdown while she was doing them because I didn't think they were bloody enough and I thought I looked horribly ugly. But you know what? They look great. They do look great. I was just stressed out. I'm gonna clean this like every day. I'm gonna be that person like this is their car. You know what I mean? I cleaned it all the time. That's me with this. Ooh. Yeah, that's not a good start. There's a thing, so you don't have to grind it yourself. You just, I've never gra grinded, grounded my own beans, but I feel like I'd be bad at it. Hello, okay, it's four o'clock, oh wait, it's four o'clock. I'm gonna leave by 4.30 and I need to do my makeup. So I did all my skincare, I just showered, did my skincare, and now I'm gonna do my makeup. So I thought I was filming for fun, I don't know. I'm not good at makeup, I'm just bare minimum, bare minimum. So I'm gonna start with putting the Ilia, this on. Even though it's nighttime, I'm still gonna put SPF on because I'm pale, skin damage, I don't know. Oh, shake, I forgot. So we're going to dinner in, oh my god. Do I even have any, ugh, I don't even think I have any left. Okay, hopefully there's a little left. There we go. We're going to dinner in Newport Beach. I'm very excited. I love going to fancy dinners, but I also hate it. I don't like going out that much, but at the same time, I love getting dressed and pretty. But I also hate doing it. It's like a, it's a day by day thing because I'm thinking right now and I want to say that I love going out. At the same time, I hate going out. I love just being at home. I'm a very big homebody. So I rubbed it all over my face. <laughs> my dogs. I think this is hourglass. It came off. I think it's hourglass. Back to the point I was trying to make. I am a homebody, but I'm not. I like staying at home, but I like going out. But then when I go out, I'm like, okay, I'm good for the next month or two. 99. Six months. I'm going out to dinner. 
for my birthday. Well, not really. Yeah, it is for my birthday, but it's not my birthday dinner. Because I feel like going to Disneyland was more like my birthday thing. I think this is just something fun to do. And it's like, oh, it's my birthday. No? So I just put that on like kind of my T zone, like up here, down here, and here. Kind of like brighten my face a little. It's basically the same shade, it just has a little tint. And now I'm gonna put concealer on my pimples. I've been using pimple patches all week and they, the pimple patches have been working, but they're leaving little scuffs, so they're so little red. Okay, now I look very pale and like a ghost. I think I'm going too slow because I still need to do my hair too, but I think I'm just going to slick it back. Okay, so this is the Rare Beauty in the shade Power Boost. It's the bronzer stick and I feel like I always put too much bronzer and it's always like, it's a... I love this though because it was sold out for a really long time and then one day I decided to go to Sephora to refill some of my skincare. Is there blush on this? Oh my god, there's really blush on it. So I might not even do my blush because, oh my god. Okay, well, this is basically blush. It's basically blush. Look at how red that is. So I can't use that. I'm just gonna wash it. I'm not gonna wash it. Uh, I'll use a beauty blender. I never wash my makeup brushes. I probably should so I can avoid scenarios like those. I don't, I don't really know how to properly use this, but I always feel like I don't do my makeup like really good. I just think it's like, okay, you look alive. Not like, oh my God, your makeup looks so good. I think it's like, okay, so you look like a normal person. But when I don't wear makeup, it's like, are you okay? Because I'm so pale. And I have this little NARS bronzer tester sometimes, and I guess I'm gonna do it now. I like to use it just like, I, like over the brown, like ooh, over the powder, just to, uh, you know, buff it out a little. My mom's way better at makeup than me. Like she always looks so good. Then I ask her to do my makeup and then it looks good, but I have patience issues. Oh, okay. it's a little much. A lot. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna use a beauty blender because I need to absorb this. I don't know. Okay, so sometimes I'll do like a white eyeliner and then sometimes I'll do a darker one. My dress is light blue. So I think I'll do it. Dark one. Okay, so this is disintegrated, but this is setting powder from Charlotte Tilbury. If you haven't been able to tell already, I'm obsessed with Charlotte Tilbury. I have like three of her eyeliners, two, I think I have two, yeah, of her lipsticks, a red one, and then, okay, so this is really random. So I have a red one and then pillow top. This is really random, I don't know if I'm supposed to do this, but I put that on and then I go in with my beauty blender and then blend it. And this takes away some of the color from the bronze, but it kind of makes it, I don't know, blend. I feel like it blends it in a little, but I still want that color. So then I'll go over it again. And I don't know if I even have to do it the first time because I already go over. I haven't tried not doing it. I'll just like probably just like a little. I don't put the bronzer on to like sculpt my jawline. Maybe I should learn how to do that. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't have like a problem with it. I don't have a problem with like my cheeks. I think I have regular cheeks. I'm still like a child, so they're not that defined. But that's okay with me. Oh, okay. Oh my god, I'm gonna wear eyeshadow actually today. I never wear eyeshadow. This is, oh my god. Charlotte Tilbury. This is really old though. I was given this like a long, long time ago. I think it was like 2020. Someone gave it to me and I was like, I didn't wear makeup at the time. So I didn't use it. I'm now using it, I guess. I still don't wear makeup that much. If, does this even look good? You can't even see it. Maybe I'll put like a little right here under my eyes. No. Okay, I'm gonna use a brown Charlotte Tilbury. Eyeliner. Charlotte Tilbury sponsored me. So I put it on my eyelid and then I always put it under because it makes like my eyes. I don't like wearing mascara because they're such long lashes. So I just put it under and it darkens my eyes like I'm wearing mascara without putting it on and making it too much. I think last time I saw you, I was making my, I was building my espresso maker. So I did it. It was very hard, but I tested the water. Like, I had to do all this stuff for the water and everything. I'm so fucking thirsty. I need to dehydrate myself. I think my makeup's done. I'm really bad at lip liner. Mm, it looks fine, I guess. I feel like, ugh, I always feel so weird when I have makeup on. I feel like this, like, I shouldn't be. And this is so old. I don't even know what brand this is. Too Faced. The lip injections. I just saw this and I haven't worn this in so long. I went through a period where I was obsessed with plumping stuff because I hate how small my lips are. I've grown to be okay with them. Kind of. Don't talk to me when I'm 18 because I might get lip fillers. I feel like it's not that bad at all. Like my mom's like, no, you don't need 
them and I'm like, why are the pillars so small? I've heard my whole life. I'm like, dentist, ortho. Every single person like, wow, you have such a small mouth. And I'm like, yeah, I know guys, I know. The makeup by Mario gel freeze, what is it? Master hold brow gel. I rotate between this and the Anastasia Beverly Hills. I like this one more because it's already on there and the other one is not. Okay. Oh my god, my lips are tingling so much. I forgot how much it's like stings. I think my makeup's done. I think I look okay. I think I look pretty good. Talk to me in an hour and I face up the Inca. Oh my god, it looks like I have dandruff. Okay, yeah, but I don't have time to get back in the shower and wash it, so I get it in the bowl because I slip my hair back so much. My bangs are at a weird length where I have to like clip them back, but I'm okay because I like them when they're down. If I ever want to put my hair up, which is very often, I have to clip them back. I'm wearing this drop. This dress can be very fancy. I bought it like three months ago just for my birthday, and I didn't have any plans yet, but I had the dress. I had the dress, but I didn't plan and the shoes or the jacket so I need to figure that out very quickly because it's 4 15 already ready I'll be right back ready <gasps> Ta -da! this is a dress you can't see it I'll show well no I'll post photos on my Instagram maybe if I look good I will I'm gonna put perfume on I got this tester for my birthday from Sephora it's Miss Dior I love it oh I love it I literally I wear it every day now this is the path, by the way. I don't know if you care. We're ready to go. Toodaloo. I'll see you when I get there. Okay. Oh my god. No. No. It's the next day, so it's Sunday today. And I get a Oh my god. Okay, so I set it up all yesterday. Very hard. Not the easiest thing. We're gonna work with this. This looks bad. I got beans. I got Emma Chamberlain's beans. Because there's a coffee place I go to that sells their beans at Whole Foods. But Whole Foods is farther than Sprouts where I bought these. So, I'm gonna use these. I read the instructions yesterday, so let's hope to God I know how to do it. I also watched so many TikToks on how to do latte art, so I'm prepared. So here's it. Okay, I should probably pull it up. I, it's really cool because there's a preset on here where you can set for your different types of bean. I mean, you can set for the different types of milk, so I set it to almond milk. I can change it, but like, I don't drink anything else. Okay, put the beans up here. God, I've never made my own coffee like this. I'm, I already, okay, so I drink cold brew. I'm gonna be, they smell so good. The dog's gonna have this, so I'm just gonna, I don't know how much to put in. Try to get a cup out. Oh, well, that's too big. These are from Pottery Barn, they're from the Great White Collection. I don't know if they still have that, but if you're curious. Put the lid back on. I'm also starving, but I need to make this before I make breakfast because, duh. Okay. Oh, I need to put I need to put a thing on it. I rotate between the Khalifa organic almond milk and Mox almond milk. Unsweetened. Okay, let's guide you through. You'll need beans in 10 minutes. Okay. Coffee tutorial. Navigate. Okay. I'm gonna make a latte. Hot coffee needs a hot cup. Preheat your cup first, place it under the water. What's the water spout? Okay, I should have probably looked at what it pointed to everything. Latte. Okay, put it under the water spout. Tap the hot water button to start. Okay. Tell us the type of beans you're using. I don't know, where does it say it? Do I put... Roast within 30 days or anything else you're unsure. I'm, I'm unsure. Use the dual 